Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this quick tutorial video on how to use the new Curse Launcher. You can go to curse.com and uh, you can download it from there or you can click Games and Minecraft. Sometimes it'll automatically install the plugin. You can just download it, install it, save it to your computer and run through the installation. Once you have it installed, it should launch. You'll need to log in. It'll be a little short window that'll log you in. Uh, then what you need to do is install the Minecraft plugin if it didn't show up. If it did show up, you'd see the little Minecraft creeper down here. If not, just click the settings down here, go to plugins, and then just enable. Uh, I don't want to disable it right now, but just enable the Minecraft plugin there, and boom, you're ready to go. And then just to install Project Ozone, all you have to do is browse all packs. Don't click Browse Feed the Beast mod packs because it only browses their mod packs. Uh, there's the back button up here, but you want to browse all packs. And then you can type in Project Ozone. It's down there anyways, but uh, Project... Ah! Can't type today. Project Ozone. And then you just hit uh, Install. And uh, normally it would install it for you whatnot, uh, except we already have it installed and that's fine. And uh, when you go back, you can just launch it and hit play. In the game for Project Own Zone, uh, you might want to change your settings, your video settings here to uh, large or medium scale because you might have problems viewing the icons here on the desktop. When you start a game, just go to Create New World. Make sure you go to More World Options and you change the type to Garden of Glass. That is the um, starting position that is recommended for the pack since it is a skyblock and then you'll have a lot of fun. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and have a wonderful day.